game starts with Brefferton playing the ball long down the line and that's going to be a throw to Meadow Park who uh, are from Division 2 of the Stratford Alliance doing very well, they've won all seven of their league games so far and Brefferton of course in Division 1 that's a really good ball forward and uh, possible chance now for Ryan Timmins to maybe get the ball across goes on the outside, low ball into the middle, flicked away by Brett and there's a long distance shot and that's not a bad effort and it's uh, over the crossbar so the free kick for Meadow Park played down the left hand side nodded clear by Brettferton and they've uh, won possession again strong challenge by Brett and uh, in fact the referee has given a free kick free kick to be taken uh, midway inside the Brettferton half right footed toward the edge of the penalty box it's headed on but uh, Brettferton can bring that away quite comfortably forward the ball goes the referee not interested in the free kick and the ball is uh, put out of play by Brettferton and free kick by Meadow Park Francis involved for the uh, the Brett Manny Singh working hard but uh, it's a bit crowded around there not surprising on this small pitch but uh, the ball is played all the way through to goalkeeper Mann he rolls it out and uh, Jarvis has actually got there first and uh, well played by Mann grabbing as the uh, Meadow Park winger tried to make something of that uh, lax play taken long by Brett into the dark area here at the home guard club long way round but uh, the ball is given away ball is played through the middle and that's gone all the way through now then Powell one defender in front of him plays it square towards Jarvis but his uh, control has let him down but I think it was probably partly due to the uh, the surface as well and that is going to be a goal kick as this uh, free kick right footed for the the Brett that swung in dangerously, headed away well by the by the park, and uh, another free kick's given away. Once again, the uh, the Division Two team trying to play football. There's the long ball played through, but uh, straight to the goalkeeper. The uh, park defence making a bit of a meal of getting that ball away, and that has to be a free kick, surely. And that's a bit of a late challenge as well. And uh, finally, a free kick is given. A bit late, mind you. Father's the culprit. Lead the ball! So we the free kick then for Meadow Park. Straight to the goalkeeper. So yet another free kick. I think that's been the, uh, the mode of the game so far. Whistle blowing. Ball is flicked forward by Brettferton. On again chance for a shot here maybe it must be surely and there's a little poke and it's in the net and it's 1-0 to Bretforton and it's Jamie Clark who's got it So here we go again, another free kick. It's been a littered start to this game. Pitch is very bobbly and very soft. In comes the ball, it's dropped wide, but uh, it has taken a touch off a defender. Now that's gonna be a corner on the left-hand side. So here we go, left side corner for Brefferton. Quite a few people in that six yard box. And that's exactly where it's gone. There's a header at the far post and that's in. And it's 2-0. Oh, now that is uh, a very high challenge, but the referee has allowed it. Beddoes flicks it on, but uh, Oh, the ball has almost escaped the goalkeeper, but he's managed to 
regain possession of this, taking the ball away as Fathers can't quite keep it in. But that's strong defending and uh, that's going to be a goal kick. Well, that's run through to the keeper. Meadow Park getting to the byline and that's a very hard cross and it's swung out of play. Good head forward there by Morris. Powell is uh, splendidly challenged by Manny Singh. And well, it's a throw, an offensive throw for the team from Division 2. Couldn't have uh, dreamt about a worse start. That's a nice turn into the penalty area. And the ball goes out for a goal. The Meadow Park skipper, Horton, will hit the free kick from just over the halfway line. Easily headed away by Bretforton. Won back by Park, and they played it all the way through to the goalkeeper, who does well against Jamie Clark. But his clearance has to be fought for by Benson. Inside it goes to Powell, nicely turned on the ball. He's going to try a shot from outside the penalty box, and that's disappearing into the darkness. And Beddoe's getting the ball on, and uh, once again, Meadow Park finding it difficult to clear the ball. Fathers clipping the ball into the penalty box, headed away by Park. And uh, Meadow Park lobbed the ball on, and the chase is on. Powell working hard, but the defending was done successfully there by Brett. And it's a throw left side to Meadow Park. There's no width on this side. Now there is. Burford is here, and he receives the pass. Little pass inside. Now then, what can they do from this angle? And it's once again a goal kick. Strong defending by Brett yet again. Very physical. There hasn't been a free kick for a little while. Oh, there is now. Another left side free kick for Meadow Park, needing desperately to get back into this game. Half an hour gone just about, it's headed goalwards by Horton. A chance at the far post, but no shot came in, and the ball was cleared. And Burford's pass goes out of play. Long ball played forward by Brett, and they've got a chance here through Beddoes. The shot takes a deflection, and that is a very late challenge by Beddoes. Benson winning the header, then uh, picking up the clearance. But two people sliding into the challenge there, and that's going to be a free kick. And that might just be a booking. I don't know. Got a, a, a left side free kick. It's an offensive free kick for Meadow Park. I think there's been a caution. Not sure who the card was shown to. It's very difficult to tell in this murky light. In comes the ball, but far too easily headed away. And there's the sliced shot. Still leaves the, the park in with a chance here. Out to the right, Horton gets it across, and that is a corner. Burford will take this corner right-footed from the right flank. Over comes the ball, there's a header, but that's gone over the bar. Okay, here comes the corner from the left-hand side. Lots of movement, edge of the penalty box here. In comes the cross. And the goalkeeper catches that well enough, and uh, the referee has given a free kick. Anyway, Brett throw, but uh, once again the ball is contested and untidy. Goalkeeper Allen clears the ball up the line. That's a good ball, actually. Now then, Jarvis has the defender going backwards, and the ball's just bobbling all over the place. And there's the cross. And that has gone in! What an amazing finish! And it's 2-1. A 
That's the free kick once again to the Division 2 team. Little touch by Powell, and once again he's got his foot underneath the ball and uh, slightly pummeled forward by Meadow Park. It's untidy. Powell getting the challenge in there. And which way has that gone? It's gone to Bretherton on that occasion. Burford. Free kick. Right flank. Floated in straight to the goalkeeper though, but uh, it would have gone straight to the goalkeeper. Nodded away by Bretherton. Meadow Park finding it too tight on that side. Ball played back to Burford, and he's given the ball away, and there's the long ball, which Clark will chase, but Allen is out to clear. And the ball breaks for Bretforton. Now, Meadow Park doing well to defend that, but they've given it away again, and there's a free kick. Free kick then to Meadow Park. They've certainly come back into the game a lot more. It's well struck, headed away well by Bretforton. And that's going to be a free kick. Again, another free kick to Meadow Park. We've had so many free kicks in this opening period and it's spoilt the game completely really. There's been no flow whatsoever. And that's headed away by Brett and and that's another free kick. And the ball's been kicked away as well. So that's going to be a booking, I think, for Horton. And with that foul throw, it's half time and uh, it's 2 1 here. Bretforton leading Meadow Park. And a very untidy half to watch. I feel sorry for the spectators. So the second half is about to start and. Uh, Meadow Park still have quite a bit to do. They've actually been out for quite a while. Um, and there they go. There's the long ball played forward, I think, by Benson. And there's the first free kick, given away by Morris. Morton to take the free kick for Meadow Park. Out to the right-hand side it goes, but uh, well won by Brett given away, no foul that time apparently but that time there is a foul we've got a free kick an offensive free kick for Meadow Park in it goes, it bounces through and Skipper Horton has the ball plays it low to the near post and that's easy for Mann Powell has uh, broken onto that and he's being grabbed by Singh and uh, that is likely to be a caution, surely it must be. Here's the free kick then, it's possibly Taylor who is going to hit it. Right footed, he looks to be setting himself. There he goes and it strikes the wall. Taylor pokes it forward and that's offside. Another free kick and this time to Bretforton. It's just one stoppage after another. Not what people have come to see really. In comes the cross towards the far post, and that's gone too far. One left towards Clark. But uh, goalkeeper Allen will come out to collect that and roll it clear. Burford loses possession, and uh, Bretherton playing the 1 2. I think that's Beddoes, and he slipped as he tried to hit it. And uh, Meadow Park can bring it away. But once again, final pass. Doesn't work. Jarvis tries to slip the ball out to his fullback, and there's another strong challenge. Once again, Bretforton push forward. They're having a decent spell. Start of this second half now. But it's an attritional game, it's just physical. Ball is knocked forward. No offside, but uh, there's a challenge from behind. And it was Fathers that time. The ball is broken for Bretforton. Now, 
Clark turning on the ball. A precious little opportunity to show his skills. That's a good ball down the line though. In comes the cross towards the outside of the penalty box and it bounces on but uh, straight through to the keeper. Good turn by Powell and he's still going. Oh dear, and he's gone in a little bit late there. And the fight starts. This was inevitable. The free kick does go to Meadow Park, even though Powell has got his booking. And that's harmless. The ball won again by Bretforton. The goalkeeper's kick didn't go too far. They've got a chance here. The ball's flipped inside, but Meadow Park managed to scramble the ball away. Once again, they've given it away. In comes the left foot cross and Clark is around. Needs support. Herborn is giving him that support, number 12. Foles helps him, but uh, he has won the throw. Oh no, it's gone the other way. Lobbing it on and there goes Beddoes. Goalkeeper hesitates. Defender clears. Free kick six or seven yards inside. The park half is hit down towards the right hand side. It's lobbed into the middle by Jarvis, but straight to the goalkeeper. There's some very slack control by some of the players at the moment. I don't know whether they've, they're tired or whatever, but um, it's described as scrappy at half time by one of the spectators to my left. And uh, that just about sums the whole thing up, really. It's a cup final. I suppose one comes to expect a few thrills and spills, but it's been stop start, free kick, long kicking, and there's another free kick. I've got a free kick just outside the penalty box, probably about 22, 23 yards, and it's going to be uh, swung in right footed. Of course, the uh, second goal scored was from a left side corner. Headed in at the far post. There we are again. And that's just about hooked clear. There's a right foot shot which is blocked. And throw taken by Meadow Park. Nice turn by Benson. That's really good football. But he can't find the pass. Singh picks it up in defense and he's got the pace. Plays it with his right foot, and uh, that should come back to the goalkeeper. Does well enough. And it's cleared by Hall to throw for Bretforton. Headed clear, and there's a bit of a break on now for Meadow Park. And that's a hold back, and that should be a booking. Long free kick. Up go the heads. There's a bit of a, a deflection. Ball falls to... Jarvis, but there's some good strong defending by Bretforton. They've managed to get it clear. Not too far. Still untidy by that byline. Bretforton finally get the chance to clear, and they do so. Back come Meadow Park. The ball breaks forward to Clark, and he's quickly challenged and loses possession Benson but it's very crowded in that midfield and they've done actually quite well to keep possession here and that's uh, Roman Timmings but he gives the ball away and the ball is played back to Allen. <laughs> Away they come. The long ball played up the right hand touch line and cleared by. This is uh, playing on this left hand side in, uh, in place of Roman Timmins. But they need a goal. Bretton. Not really under any pressure. Goalkeeper hasn't really made a save. 
Powell loses possession. Ball is played through long. Cut out by Eads. Knocked forward, but far too easily cleared by Bretforton. Middleton playing it back. In comes the left foot cross, but that's intercepted. Ball is played out left to Jarvis again. Cuts inside neatly. And still going. But can't find the pass. One back by Meadow Park. Played through towards Powell. Now then, Ryan Timmins does well to cut inside. There's an attempted shot, and that's well wide from Benson. Benson won the ball in the air. Ball comes to Clark. Turns smartly. Ball is played out to the left hand side, but should be defended by Horton. Evades the challenge. Still has the ball. Plays it inside to Taylor, who loses possession. And the ball's given away again by Bretforton. And Jarvis making towards the edge of the penalty box. Benson gets in the right foot shot, but that's well over the bar. Ball runs through to Allen. Meadow Park need to put some pressure on the Bretforton goal. That's nicely played though. But again, the pass is too easily intercepted. Hammered away by Bretforton. Eads swivels it left to Jarvis. Once again, he sets off on a run, but he's fouled. Timmins then with the left side free kick. But again, there's no height on it at all and easily cleared by Bretforton. Only put straight back to Timmins. Looking for somewhere to go. Finds Jarvis. Low cross again. Easily hooked away. Morris plays it forward. Bit of pressure now from Meadow Park, but still not getting past this Bretforton defence. Protecting man extremely well. That's a good run. And still a good run. Played inside. An attempted shot, but it wasn't going anywhere. That's well played. And the ball is hacked clear. Lots of promise, but no finish. That's a good tackle by Eads. To Jarvis. Does well to get inside that time and goes past the second defender. Still going. There's no penalty, but the ball nearly goes in. Here we go with the penalty kick. It was a penalty, and uh, Horton, the skipper, is going to take it, and he's had it saved. So what a chance that was for Meadow Park to regain parity. Benson battling on the left-hand side, gets the ball across and it's smashed away by Bretforton. Eads, he gives the ball away. It's kicked clear by Bretforton anywhere at the moment. That's a really nice bit of play and away they go again. But this time, Bretforton get the tackle in, and uh, that's, that's pretty good defending that time. Handball. We've got a very deep free kick. It's about eight, nine yards inside the Bretforton half as another substitute comes on. All or nothing now for Meadow Park. They've had a good spell. Missed the penalty. And... Uh, it's getting desperate. Keep the line. Keep it. Manny, where are you? Here. Jamie. Just about ready now. Linesman makes his way to the, the line of attack. And the ball is hit very high. Up go the heads. Good punch by the keeper. Player falls down. No penalty that time. And the break is on for Bretfordson. There's the long ball. Here we go. Another free kick. 
kick. Again, this time about 11 yards inside the Bretton half. It's been shoved forward by the player. And he's been told to take it back, but he hasn't taken it back too far. And the free kick goes in. Easily headed away by Bretton. Meat and drink to them. The ball is cleared high. Out of play. And uh, it's a throw for Meadow Park. Trying to get the ball back. So, a free kick to Bretton. Moving into the last five minutes of this game. They're under a little bit of pressure, but... Ball has fallen to Meadow Park, and that's another foul. Very deep free kick for Meadow Park. But uh, one in the air by Clark on that occasion. Nicely controlled by Middleton. And another free kick, I think. So a little touch on and Singh kicks it away. It's going to be a throw left side as we move to the final moments of this cup final. Aaron Smith cup final. At the Home Guard Club in Stratford in Tiddington. So it's all or nothing now for the, uh, the team from Division 2. And in fact, the game is over. And Bretforton have won this cup. Uh, defeated Meadow Park team step forward to take their medals they certainly battled hard as the uh, game wore on but just couldn't find their way through the stubborn Bretton defence and when they did and uh, secured a penalty the home keeper man made a diving save down to his right to prevent Horton from equalising so it uh, remains now for Bretton to receive their medals too. And then the trophy, of course. So here are the uh, victors, Bretton, who've uh, held on to win this game by two goals to one, picking up their medals with big smiles, bigger smiles. Jamie Clark, one of the goal scorers. A little thumbs up. And uh, the cup is there, and uh, here he goes. Cup winners, Bretton FC. I might sing that. Jamie Clark, seen it all before. The uh, team photo has just been taken and uh, we like to video it really, don't we? Who are we looking at? Which one? We need the packet. We don't know what. I've got a packet. <laughs>